The CD-ROM or DVD drive is found on the front of office computers and on the side of notebook computers. These allow you to play videos and CD-ROMs. To use the drive, press the button on the front of it. A tray will slide out. Now select the disk you would like to play and remove it from its container. To do this, you need to press down on the central part of the disk until it comes free from the case. Try not to touch the shiny surface of the disk while you are handling it. Place the disk on the tray shiny side down and gently push the tray back into the computer. The computer now takes over and reads the information on the disk. The DVD or CD-ROM should start automatically after about 30 seconds. If it doesn't, double-click on the My Computer icon on the desktop and then double-click on the DVD or CD-ROM drive. This should start the disk for you. If this screen appears, double-click Play DVD Video. If you have a DVD movie or select Open Folder, then click OK if you are using a CD-ROM. There is often a menu at the beginning of DVDs and CD-ROMs. Use the mouse cursor to select the part of the CD-ROM or DVD to play. Usually, you'll need to click just once to start the action. In this example, clicking on the large buttons at the top will open separate pages that allow you to make selections of what to view. It could be a video, a quiz, or a manual. A quick way to exit from a CD-ROM or DVD is to hit the ESC button, Escape, and then click the cross on the top right-hand corner. When you've finished with the disc, push the Open button on the DVD-CD-ROM tray, remove the disc, and replace it in its container.